Welcome to a new series that I am putting out. This is a game from my childhood. You know, eons and eons ago. It was one of the first, well, it was the second Final Fantasy game I ever played. It's always been a favorite of mine. And several years ago, somebody managed to update it for the computer. So, yay! I've already played through it once on the computer prior to starting this channel. But I decided I wanted to do it again, this time for the channel, because I love this game. And I love that they've done some updates to it and the, um, the, the graphics are a little bit better than when it was done on the Super Nintendo. But, yeah, that's... It, it's gonna be a... Ooh. I think I'm gonna go with hard. I've always only done normal. I'm gonna go with hard. You know, might as well make it more entertaining. But these are so... The, the graphics have been enhanced when they redid it. So we're just gonna... Watch some of the cutscene here. Lord Captain, we're nearly to the Baron border. So we are. The trouble's him, too. Orders may be orders, but this, this goes too far. Some of the cutscenes are far more intriguing, too. They put Lord more Captain. thought into it. We are the Red Wings, the pride of Baron. Must we now be thieves sent to plunder from the weak? Enough. But Lord Captain, the Mycidians offer no resistance, and still we cut them down. Listen to me. We did no more than what our kingdom's peace and prosperity required us to do. The Mycidians knew too much of the crystal and its secrets. His majesty deemed it so. We are the Red Wings of Baron. It is not our place to question the orders of our king. Lord Captain. Lord Captain! Monsters of the Boar! Okay, first combat. They are evil creatures, so let's just attack them. Oh yeah, that that was special. Ow, that hurt. Well, let's try darkness. Let, let's. I also don't remember half of what anything does anymore. It's been a while. Come on. No. Oh, yeah, that, that that was good. That was good. Yes. It, it, it gets faster when, when I have more people, more party members. As I sit here gesturing with my hand, even though I don't have a face cam. Yeah, that's how things go. 14 gil. Some form of there, right. Something they chose is money. With all these monsters as of late. Disturbing, is it not? I wonder what it bodes. We've reached the castle, my lord. Well then, prepare for landing, men. My lord! Zoom! And the music, I've always loved the music in this game. Okay. 
I will try to read these. I cannot guarantee I can do voices, because even as a storyteller for Pathfinder and D&D, I suck at voices. I don't know what this guy's going to be like. Ah, the young lord returns triumphant. You did secure Mysidious Crystal, did you not? The crystal is ours. But the Mysidians... They did not even raise a hand in their own defense, Spigen. All's the better, then, is it not? Only fools would dare oppose the almighty will of Baron. Come, we must not keep his majesty waiting. I told you I'm not good at voices. A moment, my lord. Your Majesty, I fear our good Lord Cecil's faith in you begins to waver. Does it now? Indeed. Your loyalty and worth are proven once again, Captain Bygan. But the crystal is all that matters. Bring him before me. As you wish. Lord Cecil! His Majesty bids you enter. The Kingdom of Baron hails your return, Cecil. You have brought me the crystal, I trust. I have, your Majesty. It is genuine, your majesty. So it is. See how it shines. That will be all, Cecil. You may leave us now. Oh, yeah, that was me. Your majesty. Have you some other matter to discuss? Our king has granted you your leave, and yet you would trouble him further. I know it is not my place to ask, your majesty, and I pray you can forgive my indiscretion. But what is it you aim to do? Your ways are not as they once were. My men's hearts grow heavy with misgiving. As does yours. Your majesty, no, I would never doubt. Do you take me for a fool, Cecil? Do you think your treasonous whisperings escape my ears? After all I've done for you, Cecil, you wound me. This is most unfortunate, but I can place no trust in one who offers none in return. I hereby relieve you of command of the Red Wings. My liege! You will go now to the Valley of Mist instead. There is a task I would have you do. A phantom creature haunts the borders of that land, the Eidolon of Mist. You will slay it and deliver this ring to the village that lies beyond. They will know its meaning. Be gone at first light on the morrow. Your Majesty. Oh God, another voice. I beg you, my liege, reconsider. You know Cecil would not betray you. Ah, oh, Cain. I was not aware this matter concerned you. That's kind of ominous. But as you seem so eager to protect your friend, let your spear accompany his blade on the road to mist. Your Majesty, I've no more words. Take the ring and be gone, while my mood is yet fair. If that's fair, I don't know what... Hmm, I don't know. My liege! Push, push, push. Cain, forgive me. I did not mean to draw you into this. What's to forgive? 
will slay this idolon of his, and all will be forgotten. You'll be commanding the Red Wings again before you know it. Kane, You must be tired from Missidia, no? Leave the preparations to me and get yourself some rest. Alright, moving around. Let's see what they say. Rumors swarm about his highness like so many flies, but I shudder to think what might happen were he to catch wind of them. Well, he kind of already has. Rash actions are ill-advised, at least if you value your life. That, that's also ominous. Come on. I, for one, believe in our king. He's a man who is not afraid to act on his beliefs. Yeah, stealing from people. I cannot help but sense a changed air about his majesty as of late. So there's at least one of the, uh... One of the rumors, I guess you call it. I won't talk to you. What the hell are you? The Valley of Mist lies beyond our far northwestern border. I've not been there myself, but it is said to be shrouded in a fog that never lifts. Is that like armor? Is that like a weird creature? I don't know. Oh, there's another one. Come on, turn around. I want to talk to you. Okay, so I guess it is armor. So I guess some sort of weird insecty voice doesn't really fit. If our esteemed commander and Lord Cecil of the Red Wings join as one, it is the enemies of Baron who need fear. What is it? This is all my doing. Forgive me. I told you, there's nothing to forgive. What's wrong? It isn't like you to act like this. I did not train in the way of the Dark Sword so I could steal from Innocence Cain. I trained because of that His Majesty asked it of me. You mustn't blame yourself for the orders you were given. Our King had his reasons, I'm sure of it. I envy you, Cain. Cecil, so you saw me. I saw the openings you left. How do you expect to lead the dragoons if you cannot even guard your own flank? My father's blood is in me. I will lead the dragoons. Have no fear of that. You're certainly headstrong enough. No more holding back, Cecil. Fight to win this time. Well, that was an interesting memory. Don't overthink things, Cecil. You need to keep your wits about you. Or do you mean to send me off against the Eidolon alone? Of course not. We leave early on the morrow. Best get some sleep. There's also items in some various places. Not much I can do yet. Congratulations! Word has it, Missidia was a success and their crystal is ours now thanks to you. Why what? Sleeping on do- I would never do such a thing. Where do I want- oh, let's go over this way. And there's also a map that I can pull up. The White Mages. Are you a girl or a boy? I don't know. His Majesty seems almost to have regained a bit of his youth in recent days. But it's more than that. Something about him seems... different. I'm currently studying the fundamentals of white magic. A white maid should know the three C's. Kira, Kira, and Kiraga. Yeah, that, that's great. That's great. Rosie became a white mage to help you, you know. She worries for you. Try not to make her do so any more than she must. 
Yeah, that, that turns out really well. Spoiler. Oh, this way. Talk to the Black Mages. I like, I kind of like their robes, but they're not black, they're blue. That's, that, that's just not right. Supposed to be black. We've been ordered to conduct magical research to aid his majesty's war effort. That, that's nice. Sleep! Huh? You, you don't even feel sleepy? That's odd. I could swear I did it right. <laughs> that spell actually kind of sucks. Not all monsters can be felled by such simple spells as fire, blizzard, and thunder. Ancient tomes speak of magic vastly more powerful, but all true knowledge of such things is long forgotten. Hmm, yeah, that, that makes sense. What's over here? I'm not gonna go there yet. That's gonna take me to my quarters, to the bed. And to a little... meeting with Rosa. The provisions within this chamber are yours to employ as you see fit. The switch upon that wall controls the mechanism that opens the door. Yeah, th th this little thing right here. That doesn't look like a mechanism to me. It looks like just... A, like... some sort of decoration. Four hundred and eighty money. An ether, which that restores mana. And a tent so I can sleep. Outside. Let's go over here. Now, I will say that the, the, the castle music does get kind of old after a while. Just a little. What do you say? The vault below houses Baron's ancestral treasures. Entrance within is forbidden in the name of His Majesty the King. I want to go anyway. Can't do it. Come back to that later. We are in the courtyard. Another day, another sleepless night of work. I, I mean, I sure love my job. I do. You uh, be sure to tell the fleet master that if you see him. Haven't seen Fleetmaster Sid, have you? He's been like a ghost, leaving all the airship repairs to us. Seems distant when I do catch a glimpse, too. Hence of like, hmm. Well, apparently something's on his mind. This tower is closed by His Majesty's orders. He certainly closed a lot of places off. balls. That was kind of a waste of time, wasn't it? Okay. Yeah. What do you say? The provisions within this chamber are yours to employ as you see fit. Oh, wait. I already talked to you. Yeah. I thought I was supposed to see, see her in my bedroom. Been a while since I played this. That's kind of a... They, they did update her outfit a lot. Thank goodness, you're all right. The orders from Missidia came so suddenly I'd worried. We're fine. Small wonder, considering we fought mages who did not fight back. Cecil! I'll visit you in your tower later! Of course. <laughs> I'm four years old sometimes. Uh, I think I can go see... Sid. This work. 
Well, well, look who's home. Come on, get moving, dude. Rose has been worried sick about you, you know. Make that girl cry and you'll have me to answer to, you hear? Speaking of girls, how are my babies? Didn't burn out any engines, did you? You and them goons of yours need to treat those ships with more respect. Hey, why the long face? Something the matter? Sid, I, um... What? And he's sending you to hunt the Eidolon instead? But what'll happen to the Red Wings without you? I tell you, something's gotten into his majesty. He's ordered me to build a new ship, you know? A more maneuverable one, with more firepower. What's he thinking? I'm not building these things for him to wage war. Then what are they for? There's talk among the townspeople, too. Everyone's worried about where Baron's headed. And now the king's sitting... <clears throat> and now the king's sending you away from us? Missed, eh? Well, you take care of yourself. Suppose I don't need to worry about you, though, do I? I'd best be on my way, too. That daughter of mine is going to wring my neck if I spend another night here working without checking in at home. Now I'm gonna go interrupt. Uh, who the heck? Oh, right. Greetings and salutations, sir knight. My name is Naming Way. I travel the world bestowing new names upon those dissatisfied with the ones they already possess. But as of late, I find fewer and fewer wishing to take advantage of my renaming services. What say you? Won't you try a new name on for size? Yes. Yes, I will. Alright, so we're gonna... Okay. We're just gonna go with Manifest. Ma. Oh, only five characters. Hmm. Oh, that's. No. Mm -mm. Dang it. God, I remember being able to put much longer names in before. Well, why don't we do something just complete... No, that's too Star Wars-y. Fudge. Because this is like the only chance I get to do this. I have to think of something really snappy. Um... Well, let's just, you know, do that. Okay. Oh, dang it. Use a keyboard to enter the name. Press enter to. Well, I, I want to validate. Hmm. Ah, oh, dang it. I'm not, it's not going to let me do it. No. Ah. Well, this is disappointing. I seem to be stuck. So, huh, I'm going to stop. I'm going to go ahead and end everything right here for this episode and then try to fix this or if I have to play back through again. But if you've enjoyed this, check us out on Twitch. We, we do mostly World of Warcraft out there, but we are going to work in on Twitch more often. 
And that's going to be twitch.tv slash Malthrassy. You can also, obviously, like, subscribe, comment on the video here. And we also have a Twitter, which I, I'm still working on. It, it, I'm there. We're, we're, we're looking at it. So, catch us there, too. But, otherwise... I will see you on the flip side. Bye-bye.